Amy Schumer is getting honest about her postpartum experience and revealed why she fired her doula, who just so happens to be Penn Badgley's wife. On a recent episode of the Gossip Girl Lums podcast, Pod Crushed, Amy opened up about some of the insecurities she felt after becoming a new mama to son Jean and why Penn's wife, Domino, was just a little too lovely to be around. Quote, Domino is like a goddess. She's an actual floating siren around the house. She's so, like, just lovely, and when she touches you, just kind of melt. And she was really a family member, and I just felt so vulnerable. I was like, I can't have this Bocelli f- goddess floating around my house when I'm, like, bleeding out. The comedian admitted that firing Domino for being wonderful is, quote, pretty unfair, but Amy noted that she was just going through it after welcoming her and her husband's first child via C-section back in 2018. Quote, I just didn't have the strength to allow myself the luxury of having her around our home. I was like, I think you can't come anymore. Amy was extremely open with fans throughout her pregnancy about her battle with hyperenesis gravidarum, which caused her to experience frequent nausea and vomiting. And in 2020, Amy got candid about her journey to motherhood with Access Hollywood's Kit Hoover. Did you always want babies? No. No. (laughs) I truly never, that was never like, I never, you know, all my little friends would play wedding or play like they were a mom. And I was just like pretending to be different characters. I never, I wasn't that person. I never even thought about having kids until I met my husband and I wanted to have kids with him. So, I mean, it's really funny. And now I'm like, you know, I don't even want to imagine what it would be like without Jean, you know, but no, I was not someone who wanted kids at all. Um, who's the first person you told? My sister. I mean, you got it. Well, Chris. Yeah. <laughs> we'll take him out of it. I guess after him. Yeah. Yeah. But I was kind of like, I told him so that I could go tell my sister, you know? Um, yeah. And did but, you have any idea what was in front of you? Because I felt the same way you did. I thought no, no one prepared me for what was coming. I was so elated, and then it was a st- it was a quick downhill. <laughs> and then the storm hits. Yeah, like you find out you're pregnant, and then there's like a thunderclap, and you go, what, what what was that? And then yeah, and then you're like, oh, yeah. I just I felt like I really was not informed about what pregnancy might might bring, and uh, yeah, and so that's kind of one of the goals of the documentary 